Hi guys, welcome back. Apple has just rolled out the second public beta of WatchOS 26 and TVOS 26 for Apple Watch and Apple TV users enrolled in the public beta program. This release comes two weeks after the first public betas were made available. Participants can install WatchOS 26 and TVOS 26 by signing up on Apple's beta website and then downloading the updates via the settings app on each device. It's worth highlighting that both updates feature Apple's brand new liquid glass design, shared with macOS Tahoe and iOS 26. This aesthetic emphasizes transparency, soft animations, and rounded interface elements for a more polished look. On Apple Watch, WatchOS 26 introduces Workout Buddy, an Apple intelligence-powered feature designed to encourage and guide you during workouts. The Workout app has been redesigned. The Smart Stack now offers more actionable suggestions, and the Messages app gains live translation along with improved smart replies. The phone apps called Training and and whole assist features have also arrived on the watch and for the first time the notes app is available allowing you to create and access notes directly from your apple watch and for apple tv TVOS 26 brings Apple Music Sync with the ability to use your iPhone as a microphone plus lyric translation and pronunciation tools. FaceTime now supports incoming call notifications and contact posters while new AL screen savers enhance the viewing experience. Additionally, you can now set an AirPlay speaker as your permanent audio output for your Apple TV. Now that you have got access to the public betas of WatchOS 26 and TVOS 26, take them for a long spin and say your thoughts about them and I'll catch you up in the next one.